Hello everybody, it is soon to go back for another mod showcase in Jurassic World Evolution. And yes, it's not long to go, but we got four more beauties to show off. And yes, we have lightning dinosaurs to show off this time. So, without further ado, let's not mess about, let's get on with it. Uh, which one should we do first? I will do Stracosaurus first, since this one was probably the most straightforward of the four. Right, so without further ado, let's bring out Staracosaurus. Yes, we finally have a Staracosaurus in the park, and wow, I'd probably say this one is re I did a really good job on this one. And this one's definitely, in my opinion, the best looking skin in this showcase. Oh, I should have done it last now, and he's gone, and he's gone in the bloody forest, so I can't see him. And yeah, the Staracosaurus was not relatively, was relatively straightforward. I mean, the only difficulties was getting, like, a good image of, the like, the front, the crest facing towards you. Yeah, I think that is, that is the big issue with a lot all these lightning dinosaurs is the crest. Like the bodies seem relatively well, are relatively easy. It's just one color for mo pretty much all of them. But the crest, well, the crest is what makes the lightning dinosaur look nice, I suppose. And yeah, I think yeah, I did a pretty good job on the crest. It's, you can tell straight away it's from Dinosaur King. And the patterns by her look pretty good. And especially it looks a lot nicer now that I blended it in. And If you can look very closely, you can see that the underbelly is a slightly different colour to the overbelly. But, it's, but I did a really good job blending it in, so you can't really no, tell the difference. And you can't really tell where it separates unless you zoom right in. But yep, yeah, that is Styracosaurus. Oh, look at him munching away. Right, next on our agenda. Uh, we'll do Taurosaurus next. So, ladies and gentlemen, the Taurosaurus. At least I hope it is. Yes, we have this lovely ass Taurosaurus. Zoom in, capture mode before it goes into the bloody forest again. And um, this one, well, the body was easy. I mean, it was just all green. But, you know, you when you actually make these skins, there are these such fine details that you barely, that you don't even notice when you actually play the game. And if you look here, yes, I have splodges on the belly, on the body. The Taurosaurus actually does have these. And the, like, it's one of those details you just heavily overlook. And you just think, oh, it's just a green body. But no, it, it does have, like, these brown patches. But, yeah, that's enough about the body. Underbelly, like, that was pretty was straightforward. The colour was straightforward. The biggest difficulty was this bloody, was this crest. I mean, I, yes, it has the two circles, and I did blend it in pretty well, but... Like this by here, and by here, this is actually improvised. Like I don't even know if the Taurosaurus has this pattern. Like, I could not find a really high quality image of the crest by ear. So this is basically improvisation on what I think it looks like. So I may be completely off the mark, but I, th I think I got it relatively right, but I might be off the by a mile. Another issue with this Taurosaurus in particular, it was the model of the crest itself. Like, the Taurosaurus crest looks a lot different to this crest here. And the other, and the fact that the, the crest in Dinosaur King doesn't have any of these spikes, it's just all red. So, a lot of issues I had to work around with to get the crest looking relatively nice. But, overall, I think I did do a good enough job to make it look recognisable as the Taurosaurus from Dinosaur King. 
Oh, why am I zoomed out all the way up here? So yeah, zoomed out. It does look a bit weird, actually, but it is. It does look like that. Right, that's two down and two to go. Uh, we'll save Triceratops for last. We shall release the Pentaceratops. And yes, there is a reason it's wetland pattern. Okay, we have our Pentaceratops here, and one issue I have with it already is the color. Is this color by you? I, I think it's a little bit too dark for my taste. So that's probably an edit I'll make off camera. Issue number two is that it was the orange color. That's why I used the wetland button, because on the normal Pentaceratops... No, 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 come back. Damn it. On the normal Pentaceratops, this orange is a lot more paler. It's more like this colour by you. Issue number three was uh, was that most of the this black colouring has had white outlines, which seems to have pretty much been blended in when I used the smooth tool. I mean, you can uh, you can see bits of it by you. I mean, it's not like standout white, but it does look white. So yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably have to change the black a little bit off camera. But for now, that is our Pentaceratops. I go on, go in the woods. Right, last but not least, and probably, you might not think it, the most challenging one. The Triceratops. And yes, we have our Triceratops, and yes, it does look... It, it don't look like the Dinosaur King one, but it, that really is what it looks like. I mean, the Triceratops isn't a very colourful dinosaur in general, but it's mainly the crest. With the green pattern by ear, is the main colour of the Triceratops. And then it has like a little pattern on the face, and a bit of green splodges here and there, which I blended in quite nicely. Um, the actual body colour was quite difficult to get right because I originally used the 1993 model and that for some reason just did not work out so I had to change it to the normal Triceratops which has worked out and if you actually look at the crest here this crest is actually a slightly different colour to the to the whole ah, you, you can you can see the slight differences in the colour by you and yes the Triceratops does have that I mean it's it's like I said with the Storacosaurus, it's like so many, so many, no, Taurosaurus, there's so many details on these dinosaurs that you don't even notice when you play the game. But when you actually look at the model and make the skin, you just pick out all these little details that make this di make the dinosaur what it is. And the Triceratops is one of them. Um, improvement? Well, I'd probably make this a little bit brighter, maybe. I don't think the Triceratops is this dark, but, you know, I think it looks accurate enough. I mean, zoomed out, it looks pretty good, but, you know, zoomed in. Maybe a little bit of a brighter colour. Right. Now that that's out of the way, we can begin the fun. And yes, it wouldn't be a, sh it wouldn't be a mod showcase if we didn't see these guys kill some dinos. So, we're going to release a bunch of carnivores. Uh, well, uh, weaker ones, weaker ones. Okay, we'll, we'll save the apexes for another time. So let's chuck out the dinos. And I hope I have re managed to replace the mods I had before with the with the right mods. I'll be very annoyed if I didn't. And yes, we have four more genetically modified versions of these guys. Yeah, we'll release these as well. Sonic will release everything. Okay, yes, Sukumimus is back. And it also includes the return of Megalosaurus. Oh, oh, 
Hang on, there's a fight between Baryonyx and Triceratops. I need to see it. No, not Triceratops, Taurosaurus. Go on, Taurosaurus. I mean, it should win. I mean, look at it, it's a bleeding tank. Okay, Carnotaurus and Triceratops are having a fight. Oh my god, what Taurosaurus is dead? Ooh, Albertus! Oh, Pentaceratops getting a hit. Albertus is getting a Pentaceratops. <laughs> oh, Pentaceratops is dead. Yes, I think. And Triceratops lasted two seconds. Oh, there's the Giga coming out. Yeah, but we got these buffed up beasts. To kill all these carnivores. Uh, actually, should we make, we'll make four more. No, we'll keep them as they are. If we need to, we'll make four more. We're going to see each one of these ceratopsids get a kill. And yes, I have an influx of carnivores, because carnivores are the only ones I like to fight. Yes, Megalosaurus makes a comeback. Is that, ah, there he is. The Megalosaurus. Yeah, actually, this is a good example to show why the Triceratops, why the 1993 Triceratops just didn't work, is because it actually had this pink colour. No matter how dark I made it, it always came out this colour. And that is pretty much why I had to switch, switch Triceratopses to the normal. Ooh, ooh, hang on, we got a fight by it. Baryonyx against Pentaceratops. Ooh, I think this is going to be a kill for Pentaceratops. Um, you know what sucks is that only Chomp in the anime had lightning moves. But we're gonna change that. But I'm gonna have a find a way around that and give all pretty much all the lightning dinosaurs a move. Oh damn it, I released that Pentaceratops wrong. Oh here we go. We got a kill for Pentaceratops. I picked him up! Victory! Ooh, ooh, hang on. We got a fight between Albertosaurus and Sars. Stratosaurus stood no chance against the mess that Albertosaurus. Is it Stratosaurus? Ooh, yes, yes. We got Albertosaurus against Stratosaurus. Um, yeah, I can give Strachosaurus Lightning Spear, since it did use, since it did, it was meant to have Lightning Spear in the anime. Oh, never mind, Strachosaurus died. Oh, don't say that was the buffed up one. Was it? Oh, I think it was. Right, new Strachosaurus. Jungasaurus biting the dust against Ceratosaurus. I know I kind of treat this like a mini battle royale, but it's, it's not. It's just meant to be a showcase to see these lightning dinosaurs get some kills. I mean, the Pentaceratops has got a kill, so he's so he's done and dusted. Gotta wait. Yeah, get your butt out, you buffed up Ceratosaurus. Ooh, he's controlled by the Alpha Gang. And these two just don't want to fight. This guy's just sleeping. Go on, guys, fight. Ooh, the Albertosaurus twins are coming over. Ooh, the fight between Pachyrodontosaurus and Spino. Ooh, ooh, hang on, here we go. We got a fight between Pentaceratops and Megalosaurus. Go on, Pentaceratops. Oh, oh, the car's getting pulverized. Oh, we got another hit. Go on, Pentaceratops. Did he kill them? Oh, he killed him! The Megalosaurus is going down to Thunder Bazooka. Boom! Right through the neck. Right through the eye. That was brutal. There, uh, Pentaceratops, the beast, the power, the mighty. 
Oh, oh no, I missed it. The Triceratops killing the Albertosaurus, the fake one. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, that's Megalosaurus dead, Kaka dead, Suku Su dead, Aku dead. I mean, eventually there'll only be like one carnivore left. And that carnival will have the unfortunate pleasure of taking on the herbivores. Oop oop, Taurosaurus is finally entering the arena. Ooh, the T-Rex is coming out. Ooh, is he going to have a fight with the T-Rex? He, he might as well, he's got 76%, you he might kill him. Ooh, it's going to be Taurosaurus against Terry, like in the anime? Oh god, god. god. Gossy should do that. When Taurosaurus wins the vote, he should fight Terry. Ooh, ooh, hang on, we got a fight between Starachosaurus and Giganonosaurus. Go on, Starachosaurus, you can do it. No, don't get hit again. Hit him. Oh yeah, look at the damage he did. Spiky boy, he did a lot of damage. Yeah, the Starachosaurus. The Starachosaurus has killed the Giga. Only because he's like buffed up to death, so... Oh, right through the heart. Um, well, a bit messed up, but yeah. Right through the heart. Right through the heart of the beast. Right, now we just need to see Trice... Ooh. Oh, it's the old rivalry. The Triceratops against the T-Rex. Oh. Yes, but this is no ordinary Triceratops. It's a buffed up Triceratops, so you better watch your tail, Rexy boy. Oh no, the Triceratops died anyway. Oh damn it. Right, new Triceratops. Honestly, the Pentaceratops is going to kill Ceratosaurus as well. Oh, don't fight me too. Actually, yeah, do fight, because when you take on a Ceratops, you die. Well, Ceratosaurus, I think, is done, because Pentaceratops is on like 90%. Yep, Ceratosaurus is done. Why was Pentaceratops like killing everything? Yeah, a bit late to tell me now, game. You mean the was already dead. Oh, oh right through his nose. This Pentaceratops is like taking no prisoners. Only trophies. Alright, get your butt out of here, Triceratops. The Billy Pentaceratops is stealing the show. Alright, there's a fight between T Rex and Taurosaurus. Oh, it's going to be a repeat. Oh, I got a Taurosaurus. Can you do it? I mean, the T-Rex is not in the best shape. Oh, it's a kill them? Oh, oh, there goes the car. And the T-Rex has gone down. Uh, yeah, we can use lightning strike for Taurosaurus. <laughs> right through the head. Oh, <laughs> look at that, he's like, yeah. I'm dead. Right, now only Triceratops needs a kill. Oh, don't panic. We got 100% and he's on 68. Well, it looks like we're going to have a fight between Metriacanthosaurus and Taurosaurus. And I suspect the Taurosaurus is going to win. Oh, the Metriacanthosaurus oh, gets the first bite. Whoa. Put the Jungosaurus in the background watching. He's like, yes, whichever one, I, whichever one of you dies will be my din-din. Oh, oh, let the car go past. Nope. <laughs> Oh, that's a shame. The Taurosaurus biting the dust against Metricamphosaurus. Oh, Metricamphosaurus. Like, the bloody car's gone away. Oh, come on. He only gives you a tail tap. Oh, that destroyed it. The freaking tail. He only tapped his tail. Oh, oh, oh. Because why is it Pentaceratops? Like, he's fighting everything. Killing all the carnivores. 
at the Jungasaurus, the Nate Fleet is victim of Pentaceratops. Wow. How many guys how many people have dinos this guy's killed? Four. You don't mess with the pen. Like, like the Stratosaurus has got a kill, the Taurosaurus has got a kill, but Buddy Triceratops is slack it. Oh, 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 oh my goodness! That poor cat I got pulverized! It's like I've already seen in Jurassic Park of the game where the Triceratops like rams the car against the wall. Oh hang on, we got a fight between Metriacamphosaurus and Staracosaurus. Staracarakarakarakosaurus. Um, it looks like the Strack was in much better shape, so I suspect the Metriacamphosaurus is going to die. But I just want to see Triceratops get a kill, and then we can end the session, but it doesn't want to fight! Yep, yeah, that's Metriacamphosaurus dead. Wow! Stracosaurus looks huge next to it! Oh, right through the guts! Oh, look at that, right through the guts! We guide him alive! That's what you want to see when you go on tour, isn't it? Oh, come on, Triceratops. Look, the Carnotaurus is right there. Like, kill him. Fight him. Please? Oh, hang on, hang on. Is this it? I think this is it. I think the Triceratops is finally going to get off his backside and have a fight. Yeah, you're not going to win, buddy. Oh, look at Bertosaurus charging over. Go on, Triceratops. Oh, it's over. <laughs> well, it was a bit disappointing, but at least we get to see the trike get a kill. Oh, right through the jawbone. And that is death for you, my friend. And a victory for you. Right, now that we've finally seen the Triceratops get a kill, I'm happy to end this session. So, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please leave a like, and if you and if you new want to subscribe, feel free to do so. And stay tuned for the next mod showcase, where it will be, well, one of these will be going out, because it'll be something else. But it'll be pretty much this, 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 and something else, because it won't be Kendrasaurus. This is Strange Gamer, signing out.